talk from the newsroom and the, the news publishing perspective, and then we'll work our way toward uh, some of the uh, political uh, parts of the conversation. Uh, how does this discussion of disinformation relate to everything else happening here today in Davos? Um, well, first, uh, thanks for having me as, as part of this conversation. As you can imagine, this is something I really care deeply about. So I, th I think if you look at, at um, this question of disinformation, I think it maps basically to every other <laughs> major challenge that we are grappling with as a society, and particularly the most existential among them. So disinformation, and, and the broader set of misinformation, conspiracy, propaganda, clickbait, you know, the, the, the broader um, mix of bad information that's corrupting the information ecosystem. What it attacks is trust. And once you see trust decline, uh, what you then see um, is uh, societies start to fracture. And so you see people fracture along tribal lines and, um, and, uh, and you know, that immediately undermines pluralism. Mm -hmm. And you know, the undermining of pluralism is probably the most dangerous thing that can happen to a democracy. So I really, I think if, if, you know, if you're spending this week thinking about the health of democracies and democratic erosion, I think it's really important to work your way back up to where this starts.